Welcome to Smart Decker Kuhome Tutorial. Today we will learn about basic kitchen designing. To begin, go to Advanced Tool, Kitchen and Bath. Then, go to Product Catalog to choose your cabinet. Let's start with Base Cabinet. Choose any cabinet that you prefer and drop it in the floor plan. To copy the cabinet, you can click on the copy icon. To change the cabinet size, you can go to the right side of the tab. Next, let's add in wall cabinet. You can find cabinet with dish rack under functional cabinet. If you drag in another cabinet, it will automatically snap to the other cabinet. Adjust the size according to your preference. Now let's go to tall cabinet. You can move the cabinet by using the switch control or can change the number in the box. You can find more cabinet types with accessories under functional cabinet. You can adjust the size by scaling the cabinet. Next, let's create fridge cabinet. Go to auxiliaries to add panel. You can find fridge model under kitchen appliances. To adjust the space, change the number in the box. To add in fillers, you can find it under auxiliaries. Next, you can add wall cabinet to fill up the space above the fridge. Use any wall cabinet to create a box up. To delete the handle, you can go to Style and delete the handle. Next, let's change the material. To change the material, go to Global Style. You can also change the door style according to your preference. To change the color, go to Door Material. Here are some tips and tricks for you. 
you can use toolkit style brush to copy and paste the same design to other cabinet doors. To change individual cabinet, you can select the cabinet and change it under style at the right side of the tab. To copy the material only, you can use material brush. To create countertop, go to generate countertop. Fill in all the requirements for the countertop. Design according to your preference. For material, you can find more categories at the top of the tab. Click Generate to create the countertop. To delete the side backsplash, click on the countertop then select Manual Edit. Select the line and change the edge type to no edge at the right tab. Next, let's generate skirting for the base cabinet. Go to Generate, Tokic Molding. Fill in all the requirements according to your preference. Now, let's generate a sink. Click on a cabinet and go to Generate, Sink. You can choose any type of sink and tap according to your preference. Click Generate to complete. Next, let's generate stove and hood. Click on a cabinet and go to Generate, Stove. Choose the design according to your preference. To adjust the hood, click Finish. Only then you can adjust the hood. To create the backsplash, you can use Back Panel. You can find it under Auxiliaries. You can adjust the back panel size and material according to your preference. 